Okay, I decided to come back just to show you how to place it in the microwave. Um, I think it looks fine. So, and when you open up the oven, it's going to be real steamy. So you have to be careful when you're checking it. Okay, so, I'm just going to go on ahead and just go three minutes. And it starts automatically. And it spins around. Okay, YouTubers, I shall return. Okay. So three minutes is up. Uh, I can see when I opened up the microwave, a bunch of steam came up. You're going to probably have to change paper towels while you're doing it. Okay, so... I'm looking at it. I think it still needs to cook about another minute and a half. And if you didn't have the paper towels in here, boy, it'll be, it's still steam, but you could clean that up real good. However, you have a whole bunch of grease and then have the paper towel on there. You see how the grease is dripping down? So... Okay, I'm going to put it on for about another minute and a half. Then I'll be back. Stay tuned. Okay, I took it out the oven. I still had about maybe, let's say, 14 seconds left. But once you start to smell it real good, to me, I think that's the signal letting you know. Okay, see? So... It's cooked, there might be some stuck together. Well, if somebody could let me know when you do videos, like I could have to use both my hands, huh? I don't have a tripod, especially the ones that do crocheting and knitting. If you use some kind of a, a device on your head or something for recording, okay, hold on for a minute, I'll be back. So what I got now, I just made one of these little dishes and lined it with some paper towel. So that way, because it still needs to drain some. But just easily, I took I take a fork, chopsticks or something. Hope it works, let me see. Oop. I just slide it in there so even though it's curled up, you know, it's still cooked real good. So yes, um, if you want to still have bacon, but look at all that grease, and I'm not, this is like half the pack, I'm going to be cooking another pack pretty soon, but this is half the pack, and look at all that grease that came down, so it all could be going in your body, but you still have to let it drain, I remember growing up, we always, you know, back in the olden days, uh, 60s, late 60s, 70s, 80s, you had to do it on the frying pan. I never really liked doing it on the frying pan. I mean, it got splattered a lot, and I don't know, I usually end up burning it, but I like cooking it this way. Like I said, this is um, Farmer John's low sodium, and it's still got a lot of grease in it. But yes, um, I can't remember how much it costs. I think it was between, i say, 15 to $20, probably less than that. But like I said, I got it off of eBay, and you know, this little young girl and her father, their invention, I think it's going to help a lot of people, even though you still shouldn't eat that much pork. But I'm going to try it next time with um, some turkey bacon. I'll probably do a video with that, too, see how the turkey bacon cooks up. Probably don't have to cook it up that long, though. Okay, well, thanks for watching. Here's to healthy eating. Take care, stay safe, and God bless.